And those tensions in the Middle East creating major ripples here at home on America's college campuses. Liz Kreutz has more now on the firestorm at one major university over a now canceled graduation speech. Tonight, controversy on campus after USC canceled the valedictorian's commencement speech citing safety concerns. Asna Tabassum was chosen by the USC provost to be this year's valedictorian, selected from nearly 100 qualifying students who applied. But at least two pro-Israel and Jewish groups complained to USC about the choice, pointing to Tabassum's social media activity, specifically a link to a free Palestine slideshow on her Instagram, which calls for the complete abolishment of the state of Israel. The university has to make the decision about whether this valedictorian and her propagation of anti-Semitic vitriol online is worthy of being the representative of the class of 2024. Tabassum said she is shocked and profoundly disappointed that the university is succumbing to a campaign of hate meant to silence my voice. Unfortunately, it is clear if you are a Muslim student today, you don't expect the university, your administration, to stand by you. The university's provost says the issue here is how best to maintain campus security and safety, period, and that the decision has nothing to do with freedom of speech. USC's commencement typically draws 65,000 people. University leadership has not shared details about potential threats. It kind of makes a lot of people uncomfortable, the fact that they're like putting it under safety concerns, but aren't willing to then elaborate on any of those safety concerns. The commencement controversy at USC, just the latest example of heightened tensions related to violence overseas spilling over on college campuses. Liz Kreutz, NBC News, Los Angeles.